Here's your word for the day from Calvary in Lake Havasu. Visit us on the web at calvaryaz.com. Good morning, Calvary. Pastor Chad here with your word for the day. You know, it's, it's actually easy to confess Jesus as Lord, but it's difficult to actually follow Jesus. It's easy to make a declaration of faith, but it's not easy to be the person that God calls you to be. Uh, the gospel is simple and accessible. Everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be saved. If we confess with our mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in our heart that God raised him from the dead, we'll be saved. But the challenge to follow Jesus is real. Now, the, the problem is a lot of churches will communicate the easy part of the gospel, of embracing the gospel, of claiming Jesus as Lord, and they really won't emphasize the difficult part of what it means to follow Jesus, the sacrifice, the self-denial, all of that. Uh, Jesus, though, doesn't make any bones about it. Listen to what he says in Matthew 8, verse 18 and following. He said, now when Jesus saw a crowd around him, he gave orders to go over to the other side. He's telling his disciples, we're leaving. There's people here. Uh, there's people there, too. And a scribe came up and said to him, teacher, I will follow you wherever you go. And Jesus said to him, foxes have holes and birds of the air have nests, but the Son of Man has nowhere to lay his head. Another of the disciples came to him and said, Lord, first let me go and bury my father. And Jesus said to him, follow me and leave the dead to bury their own dead. Now, uh, Jesus says following him isn't easy. In fact, when people came and said, I want to follow you, he, he delighted in explaining to them, this is, this is not going to be comfortable. This is not going to be uh, something that is easy. This is something that's going to cost you personally. He's like, look, this, this is, this, there's no place to lay your head, okay? I'm a, I'm a vagabond. You're following me. It's not going to be easy. And then the other guy comes and says, hey, let me, uh, let me go bury my dad. Now, there's no guarantee that his father was dead. He might have been saying, hey, I'll follow you after I take care of my family responsibilities, which means taking care of all that and then, and then coming. And, and Jesus just said, look, hey, when you follow me, I'm the priority. I'm more important than your family, than your business, than your uh, uh, health. Uh, I'm more important than your vacations or your retirement. I'm more important. I'm the priority. He doesn't make any bones about that. And that's challenging to us, but it's also consistent with what Scripture says throughout. I mean, in, in Luke 9, Jesus said, if anyone's going to come after me, he must deny himself, take up his cross daily, and come follow me. That, that's not easy. That's embracing self-denial. That's embracing the, the prospect of death and suffering. Uh, in in uh, Luke 14, Jesus warns us to count the cost of what it means to follow him. In, in other words, he wants us to embrace the idea that if the world persecuted him, which it did, it's going to persecute us as well. So following Jesus isn't easy, it's not comfortable, and it's not meant to be. And if we are comfortable right now, God may want us to be a little more uncomfortable as we figure out what it means for us to follow Jesus. And, uh, and if that makes you a little bit insecure, then that's not a bad thing because Jesus wants us to be willing to sacrifice everything to follow him because he's the only one who can lead to life. By the way, that's why here at Calvary, we don't just ask people to say the words, or just to verbally confess Jesus, we challenge you to have a life-changing relationship with the Son of God and Savior of the world. And if you haven't had that, we want you to experience it. Because once you know Jesus has changed your life, you'll follow him anywhere. Because you can't follow Jesus and stay the same. I hope that blesses you, and I hope you are following Jesus enthusiastically today. God bless.